Corey, we're back. We're back. Day 10. I'm running out of fingers. I mean, you. I'm out of Tomorrow fingers. I'll help you. Okay. And then we'll get a hey, toes. Nice shirt, man. <laughs> Thank you. Twitting. All right, so welcome. We are so glad that you're here, and we need your help yes, to start off our video today. Um, what do we need from them? We need some words sort like, of, from you. Like a cat, mad, have you ever, squirrel? Have you ever played a Mad Lib? Yeah. Yeah, we're gonna do one of those okay. together. Okay. So in the description of this video, we're gonna list what we need. Definitely. I think it's gonna be under us. Mm -hmm. There's gonna be a list of things that that you need to to fill in. Okay, so quickly, so it'll, it'll um, say like, how about a noun? Bus. And an uh, adverb. Oh, that's the word that is, uh, ugh. really. And a like really mad. Yeah, is okay. Yeah, it's they not can the come up with better ones. I'm not good. Um, a number bigger than two, three. <sighs> Nailed it. All right, so uh, you so need to give us like all those kind of things. Yeah. We're gonna use them for a pretty fun thing later this week. For now, though, um, we got some help with some kid jokes. Andrew asked for kid jokes, and yes. so you can send us your videos. Um, same description down under and we would love to include them. So let's see our first joke. I'm so excited about this. What's at the end of a rainbow? The letter W. Oh. 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 No, 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 no. Oh, oh. oh hey! There, I'm MC Haggis. <clears throat> The world's greatest Scottish rapper, and in this month, he's about forgiveness. Deciding that someone who has wronged you doesn't have to pay. And my beatboxing partner Seamus will be here any second, and I need to fix this because I've done something great! Hey, there he is! Best beatboxer in the entire universe! Give him a sample. Oh, yeah, you could win Scotland's Got Talent with well, that kind of skill, yeah. my friend. Yeah, you yeah, got <laughs> Listen, Seamus, I, I, I need to apologize to you about something. <sighs> All right, I went over to your house this morning to try and help you out by doing some of the chores around the house. And I put your laundry in the dryer this morning. But I, I didn't know your blankie whoopee was a part of it. And when I went back to get it, this is what it looked like. Oh, so... I'm so sorry. I totally understand if you never spoke to me again because of the horribleness of the whoopee and it's broken and it's... Oh, yeah. Oh. You, you forgive me? I, I don't know what to say. Seamus, that's incredibly good. Is this my Aquaman that hey. I gave you hey. to take the show and tell? What? Where? You, you broke my Aquaman? He broke my Aquaman! How could you? I trusted you with my most prized possession! And this is what happens! This is a collector's item! Oh! You're paying for this! Hey. You are paying hey. for this! No, 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 no! You know what? Hey. You know what? Hey! You know what I can't believe? I can't believe that I wasn't like you, Seamus! And shown you some forgiveness. I think the only way I can express how I feel is my rapping about it. Kick it! When a friend upsets you or makes you sad, it's real easy to get real mad, but instead of giving them the business, try offering up a decision that lets them know that they don't have to pay for the wrong they did to you, and that's forgiveness! So oh, word! I, try, I tried to sew that up, and but it made it worse. Yeah, and then I tried to rub dirt on it. Uh, uh, hey, yeah, you know, try to cover up the other smells, whatever. Mm -hmm. yeah, it's pimento cheese. I don't know. Uh, yeah, I, and I don't even eat. Do you eat pimento cheese? Uh, yeah, I don't know where that came from. What's at the 
What did the science book say to the math book? You've got a lot of problems. It's time again for Retro Reel. Charlie, get in here. Now stand still, Charlie. I'm gonna ask you a few questions that I want you to tell me the truth. Okay. Is your name Charlie? Yes. Good answer, good answer. Do you have a mustache? Uh, no. You're right, that would be weird. Now, did you eat my last snickerdoodle that I had hidden in my sock drawer under my picture of Linda Ronstadt inside a locked safe? No. Charlie, are you telling the truth? Yes. You actually are telling the truth. See, it, it said so right here. Oh, good. I'm sorry for accusing you. It must have been mom. It's okay. I forgive you. You know, I am the best hammer there is, Charlie. Ain't no one can hammer like me. Pow, pow, pow. That is some good hammer, pow, though. Pow, pow. You bet it is. Hey, isn't that your brother's dog? Yep. Her name is Winnie the Poodle. Wally said I could play with her as long as I didn't let her out of my sight. Come on. Let's finish that tree house. Hurry up. Last one up the tree is a swamp rat. Hey, don't push me. Uh, sorry. It's okay. I forgive you. Kinda hard to do this with uh, only one hand. It'll be worth it though. Nothing like a do-it-yourself treehouse. Especially when I'm building it. You sure like to brag, Bo, but I forgive you. Thanks, Charlie. Whistle while you work. <laughs> See, I'm even good at whistling. Oh no, did you leave the gate open, Bo? My brother's gonna be so mad. Come on, help me catch her. Uh, I think I hear my mom calling. Uh, yeah, yeah, there she is. I gotta go. I forgive you, Bo. Wally, Winnie the Poodle got out. I lost her. What? Oh no, I told you to keep an eye on her. What's that number? I always forget it. 913, what's your emergency? Horse on fire? Someone running around in a leprechaun costume? Uh, no, my brother lost Winnie the Poodle. Can you help me find her? That's what we do. Well, not really, I'm just bored. Come on down to the station. I'm really sorry I lost Winnie, Wally. I know, you should be. You're lucky we picked her up. We found her inside the 10-acre wood. I really am sorry, Wally. I didn't mean to lose her. I know, Charlie. I forgive you. I have something else to tell you, too. Oh, I like confessions. I did eat your last snickerdoodle and fool your lie detector. I'm sorry. If he ate my snickerdoodle, I'd throw him in the slammer. <laughs> Why did the kid cross the playground? To get to the other slide. All right, Andrew, we get to play a game. Today's game is called Maze Craze. And the way that it works is there are gonna four win. colors. And it's kind of played like four corners. You know how to play four corners? Yeah. Okay, so it's four corners, but with colors. And so what you can do is you can get four objects that represent those colors you can put them in a corner of the room and play along or you can just put them in front of you or you can just say red for it's up to you i couldn't get one out of two <laughs> i couldn't get a 50 50 thing right there's four. and now you're gonna make me pick from four yes there's red blue well the red kind of looks orangish but it's red blue purple and green okay okay so just pick the color and basically it's this maze okay it'll be on the screen they're going to look at it, try to figure it out, try and figure out which color would be able to get to the end, and then they're gonna yell it out. So if the first one you think is purple, it's not purple, I don't think, uh, then you would be like, okay, purple, it made it through. Purple's gonna win, purple's gonna win, and we'll see if it, they can okay. solve these puzzles. But so I, I gotta warn you. Guess which dot is gonna make it all the way through. Yeah, it starts easy, and it gets pretty darn hard. So the oh. sixth one, you might just need to shout out blue because it's going to be tough when we get down to the sixth okay. level of this game. All right, so let's play.
Thanks, guys. Um, I was not very good at that game again. Surprise, surprise. Surprise. Yeah. But, uh, hey, we want to thank you for joining us Absolutely. today, day 10. Tomorrow I'm going to need Corey's finger because it'll be 11. But remember, we need your help with that Mad Lib. Oh, yeah, from the so, beginning. Description below, the list of what we need. You send it to Corey. I don't know if we told him that on the front. Yeah. Send it to Corey, C. Jones at SoHillCC.com. Send him your answers. Okay. Yeah. Uh, Andrew, color. Red. Place to work. Southern Hills? Uh, at City Station? Best friend. <laughs> Kelly! All right, we'll see you tomorrow. You were setting me up. <laughs>